Welcome to Jerome's Live Products LLC. So this is Sage Part Two, right? For those who seen the first video, y'all seen how I burnt the sage in that video, right? But this is also another option as well, right? As you can see. This is a charcoal burner, right? This is actually a charcoal burner, right? You can actually see the little hooks on the side, right? And that's the cover, right? And you can actually hold it up and walk around the house with it, smoke out the house, smoke out the house if you want, if that's how you choose to do it, right? However, I leave it open like this and contrary to the other way I showed y'all this way I actually crush up the sage so it can actually fit inside the charcoal burner right as you can see how it's burning in small pieces right and this way is also effective as well and this way actually t tends to stay uh, lit longer, right? But the, again, you have to crush up the sage in order for it to burn like this. Well, precisely to fit inside the charcoal burner, right? So the other way that I showed y'all that way was, let's say if you wanted to actually hold the sage in your hand, right? You have some people that actually like to hold the sage in their hand. And walk around the house right that that's an option as well right but this option you know is more effective if you just want to leave it so it can stay lit longer versus you having to keep lighting the sage back again right because the sage tends to go out sometimes right that's normal that's that happens when you burn sage right so there you go right this is a charcoal burner, a charcoal burner, but I innovated and I put the sage in. So there you go, y'all see, sage 